in the 17 months through uh, our high density crime company operation, which is Operation Chanela, police have arrested 900, over 900,000 suspects. That is since uh, May last year. Uh, through Operation Chanela, we have seized and we have confiscated more than 100 illegal firearms uh, per week. Uh, just to illustrate that, just last week, we uh, confiscated 132 firearms, and uh, the previous week, we have uh, confiscated 138 firearms. Since our last briefing during the first week in September, we have seized more than 840 firearms uh, during weekly operations, and this includes high-caliber firearms used in the mass killings and robberies. Most of these firearms are seized in the province of Kosovo Natal, Western Cape, Gaute, and uh, the Eastern Cape. The Eastern, the Eastern Cape, Kosovo Natal province and also the ongoing gang-related shooting in the Western Cape need to be singled out, hence our efforts in those provinces are continuous. <coughs> our operational focus remains on these provinces. Uh, also in terms of wanted criminals, uh, we also strengthen our efforts in that regard to root out especially illegal firearms from the streets. A number of confiscation of illegal a number of confiscation from illegal miners and illegal mining operations have been made throughout the country, which includes the following, uh, cash to the value of 5 million rand found from uh, these illegal mining uh, operations, 7,308 uncut diamonds worth 32 million in, in, in were seized, 312 firearms were confiscated, 7,403 rounds of ammunition were also confiscated. 238 trucks were confiscated. Thousands of generators, pendugas, space shovels, hammers, plastic cartridges have been seized in the process. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm uh, <clears throat> pleased to announce that we are today launching the National Extortion Hotline, which uh, we now have from today. The number is 0800-911-011. You can, on this line, report extortion case. You can choose to be anonymous. We will follow uh, whatever leads you are being given. But at the same time, we want to caution that do not re uh, report lies. Do not mislead us, because if we find you that you have reported uh, things that do not exist or you are intentionally wanting to mislead us, you will be held accountable for the cost associated with our investigation. But we are urging communities to report those that are committing extortion on this line so that we can investigate and follow up and arrest those perpetrators uh, that are committing extortion. It can be extortion related to construction, it can be extortion related to spaza shop, or any other form of extortion that is happening. You are free to report it there, and we will definitely follow it up.